damn it, Trinidad James is my guest yeah. today. Yeah. Hey, hey. Yeah. Yeah. Mr. James. Yeah. Mr. James yeah. is yeah. in the building with us today. She's sipping Patron on work. I no, need this it's job. just water, man. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a Patron girl anyway. I'm more of a vodka girl. Tell them. I do great goose. What do you sip on when you're sipping? I don't drink. At all, ever. Yep, we can end this conversation right now. Okay, thanks for coming by. Amen. It was good to meet you. <laughs> <laughs> so what's up, man? I, I want to know who you are. I want to know a little something about you. I've been watching some of your um, footage and some of your interviews and stuff, and you're uh, way more reserved than I would have expected you to be from the song. Well, you see, I brought my gun this time to kill Rosenberg, but he's not here oh, yet. Oh, yeah. Ah. Catch him later. Catch him later at SOBs. He might be in there. I can't wait. Do it outside the club, though. Keep it clean. <laughs> <laughs> you said it like you did this before, Angie. Come on, man. Come on. From what I hear, that's the way to do oh, it. Man. From what I've been told. Okay, then. So what's happening, man? How are you enjoying this moment? Oh, it's a gift and a curse, man. It's a gift and a curse, I know it's curse, both, man. right? Definitely. Were you prepared for it? Yeah, I mean, in general, I, I just go ahead and tell myself the things that I know that I wouldn't enjoy. So when it happens, I'm like, oh, I already told myself I wasn't going to enjoy this. And the things that I'm going to enjoy, that's well, I Very doing? negative. Negative think. But that's a very negative way to look at stuff, no? Nah, I mean, when I say it's like, is there everything in life, you can't like everything in life because life is not perfect. Right. So there's certain things that you got to think about it. Before you become a celebrity, well, for some people or whatever, before you get any type of fame or anything, you are a regular person. Yeah. And you know how you are in regular life. So if I didn't like a, a lot of people around me in regular life, I'm definitely not going to like it now. Yes. You know what I'm saying? So, oh, I understand. You know what I'm saying? So going I into understand. the situation, I tell myself, like, you're getting ready to go in a crowd of people. Get ready for it. You know you, what I'm saying? Right. Because I got to do it. It's my job, you know? So, but now, you have to, before, you could just not deal with those people. Yeah, I could be like, I'm not going to that. What you going to do? And now. You know, I was like. Pfft, now you have to go. I got to go see Angie's face. Yo, really? I'm just playing. Thanks for, <laughs> thanks for coming by. Oh. No, I'm just playing. <laughs> <laughs> Did you look like this? Did you dress like this? If I would have met you. I don't know, six months before the music came out. Like, this is what you, is this oh, your artist? Oh, six months? Oh, yeah, definitely, Jesus. This is how you look before. Yeah, I mean, you probably can go back four or five years. I know, but you were always. Yeah, I was just doing something right. like, he's kind of weird. Some people become an artist, and then all of a sudden they start dressing like an artist. Of course. So you dressed like an artist before you were an artist. Oh, I dress like myself, and I guess that's part of the artist realm. Mm. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Like, I just dress. I, like, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Like because you, you just said it, like artists dress like, but who are they basing it off of? Regular people? Are they right. basing it off of me? <laughs> well, they get the rapper starter kit. A lot of them, they just get the chain. Well, see, I ran, I ran a boutique for four years, mm -hmm. so I've been dressing artists for ages. You dressed other artists? Yeah. Who did you dress? I'm not telling you. Why? Because I'm a doctor this and they don't tell people. This is people part of the business. things that you have to do when you become an artist. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> I was like a clear face, clear path lie, like in my eyes. Like, I'm looking at you. I I'm can't see you because you have shades on. He Wonderful. said, yeah, right. Trinidad James, is that your government name? I wish. It's not. No. What is your name? What? You don't. <laughs> <laughs> Can I give you my social security after the cameras go Did off? You just, what? Did you just hit me with a little John just now? <laughs> Something. <laughs> you can't tell me your government. This is not. Listen, when you're an artist, you have to tell these things. No, stop lying to my face, <laughs> Angie. Just because you got a cool name that went viral, that doesn't mean Actually, that my Angie, name. Actually, Angie is not my government name. What? See what? <laughs> I'm living a lie. My, oh, my ears are so raped right now. My <laughs> name is Angela. Angela Martinez. Oh, well, you see, there it's we go. It's close enough. It's yeah, close. Exactly. It's my name, name has nothing to do with Trinidad nothing. James, period. It's not like Tobago. <laughs> I don't know. It's something close to Trinidad. That was racism. Yo, on the, the whole line. entire country is not going to mess with her now. <laughs> no. I can't wait to, like, I sneak no, her to Trinidad. Like, oh, Angie, let's go to Trinidad. It's on me. And they beat her all no. the phone. In Tobago. What? Trinidad and Tobago. <laughs> hey, Tobago. <laughs> no, it, that's what? not a crazy thing that I said. <laughs> Trinidad and Tobago is close. That's what I'm saying. Is it close? No. Don't try to turn the people against me. And they're already done. <laughs> Don't try to <laughs> do that. Put in the air right now with Angie's name. <laughs> <laughs> that is so not cool of you. I thought I was going to like you. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Are you having a good time doing interviews and stuff I mean, like this? You grow. You know, you got to think about it. Like the first time I was here, that was like that was weird. early in the morning, coming at me weird. They came at you into, weird. You know what I'm saying? It yes. was all good. You know, it's like I thought about it like last week when I was like, oh, man, I'm about to go back to Hot 97. Let oh me get my gosh. guns and machetes. Mm. It's a woman, too. I can't wait. So but nah, just you. like I think about like I actually... Like, if I was to make, like, the guidelines for any new artist coming out, 
I will send them to meet Rosenberg. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Because Why is that? It, it helps you. Just in general, like, even if, like it just shows you what you can deal with. And it shows people what you can deal with right. as a person. Right. Because at the end of the day, I don't sit here and live uh, like, oh, I'm Trinidad James every day. I, I'm a regular person that does music mm -hmm. and good music, in my opinion. Right. You know what I'm saying? So it's like you don't know what you can deal with until somebody actually tests you. So, you know, Do a lot of these artists. You disrespectful. Um, I feel like he was being him. Yes. When I sit back and look I at agree. it more and then pay attention to everything, because I went and did my research. Like, is it just me? Like, Listen, what was it? Wow, like, really, I I'm, I'm really surprised. Yeah, right? yeah. I wouldn't have been mad at it. I would have liked his approach if it was later in the game, but I had never seen you or met you, and I just was all into the ridiculousness of the song. I mean that in a good way. It's no all good. disrespect. And I wanted that to see you in that. I want, you know what I mean? I wanted it to be fun. Is it, is it, I she wanted you to have fun. fun. Nah, I wanted you to be nah, fun. Nah, it's all good. See, the whole thing about it. And then he hit you with the 100,000% serious. And yeah, I was like, it, it, it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? Now, you don't like Rosenberg. You could tell us. Rosenberg, he's doing his job, and that's the way he does it. Because automatically, put like, this is exactly how the interview went for me in my head. Right. Like, you see how I was. I was sitting there, I think, at right. the time. Mm -hmm. Or whatever, and I wasn't like I was just talking like regular. I wasn't animated. I didn't have on this bright shirt. You know what I'm saying? Like I had on regular neutral. I was neutral man. It was actually you were like, neutral man. Neutral right. man. Uh huh. Well, it was early in the morning. <laughs> oh, I despise you. You despise me. Neutral man. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Anyways, but as soon as honestly, if I knew your head, government, I wouldn't have to call you sure. neutral man. I rather you call me neutral man in my real name. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna find out your real name as soon as this. It's gonna be over. easy. Go on Facebook. Could it's somebody, could you look that up for me, please? <laughs> Go ahead. Anyways. Go ahead, Tobago. <laughs> <laughs> you um, hate Rosenberg, and no, you don't want to speak right. to him. I'm not saying right that. When I was sitting there, I promise you, as soon as he said that he hadn't heard the project, and he only heard the song, automatically in my mind, I didn't care about nothing else he said. Ah. Like, as soon as he said it, like, I didn't care. Like, he, didn't, he could have said anything. So you it said you texted him yesterday, but so you guys have a relationship now. No, don't say it like that. Oh. He texts me. <laughs> I, I didn't mean that, I'm I didn't mean hey, that I'm in an inappropriate way. You know what I'm saying? Because that's how, like, when you, you see, for me, I'm what, in my opinion, I'm what you call a real true freshman. Right. Like, I'm really new to the game, new to rapping, new to all the things that come along with it. So I actually pay attention because I know what it is to be somebody who's a fan of artists and now to have people who's a fan of me. Mm. Right. So I know both sides perfectly as far as, like, how you see it. Right. And how why I see that people put artists so high up that when artists come to regular people, they look it down on them when nothing has never really changed, you know? so What does this have to do with you emailing and texting with Rosenberg? I just had to get you off that subject. No, I was not <laughs> going anywhere, though. I'm right here when we started. <laughs> but no, I mean, he texted me yesterday, like, hey, you know, I want to... What? Hit me on. He was like, definitely, like, you want to chat it up again? You know, he said he still felt strong about, you know... um certain points but he has a better idea of the tape and but that's you all exchanged really information you're on a friendly terms is what i'm oh, yeah, saying we're cool well, we okay, don't have a problem good. with him I, did, I mean i never i didn't hate him when then. it was happening you know what i'm saying like i told you when he told me he hadn't heard the project he's just at the time that's basically like he was basing ignorance. it on the one song no yeah, he was basing you know what I'm it on like, the one that's song. like okay that's like me telling you about yourself i know nothing about you i don't want to talk about it anymore yes <laughs> <laughs> say, say, i'm yes. over it Here's what I worry about for somebody like you when you have such a big record like All Gold. Uh -huh. Could you be a one-hit wonder? Right. Could that I mean, be it? Could it would... be grand opening, grand closing? I feel like with one-hit wonders, it's kind of, it's on you what you do with the music. Yeah. I feel like if you, with me, I put out a project and people gravitate to All Gold and everything. I didn't make you do it. That's true. I you didn't think they're going to gravitate to this song. I mean, that's this is usually the other song that people talk about. Like, man, I like this song too, man. When Joe Buttons was here, he was talking about this song. Joe he, Buttons the truth. He enjoys this song. <laughs> he was singing it as if it was his song. No, hey, that's wonderful. Because <laughs> the song is for people. Like, you know, it's, music is for the people listening. That's yeah. right. So if you can relate. Thank God, because the more people can relate, the more people are going to like it. All right, tell them about this song. Um, it's called Females Welcome. Mm -hmm. um, the hook is the most catchiest part or whatever. My side chick is my main chick because my main girl mm -hmm. ain't feeling me mm -hmm. no more. She don't love you no more. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And, like, I mean, you could also twist that for a woman 
That's you know what, what I. That's like, what I'll choose to do when we play it. Hopefully you do. Okay. Angie. <laughs> okay. Good. Find, let me find out. <laughs> Chill out, Nicholas. <laughs> Chill out. Okay. Okay, Angela. <laughs> <laughs> Trinidad James is yeah. not being sued by Martin. <sighs> I wish. <laughs> Counter suing is always fun. That would be shout a good... out to Judge Joe Brown. Let me see what is true about this little packet they give me. Is this your girlfriend? Oh. What? Keeper. Let me see. There's a girl here, and it says her name is Keepa, and they say this is your girlfriend. Um, send me over the um, uh, the, the mugshot, picture. please. Here, go look at her. <laughs> he said the mugshot. <laughs> mm, I wouldn't talk to her. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't talk to her. I mean, come on. So this is not your girlfriend. Man, please. So what, do you have a girlfriend? No, I don't. Okay, what would your girlfriend look like? I don't know. You're just going to sit back and see. She wouldn't look like Keepa. We know she won't look like Keeper. <laughs> Keeper don't even look like Keeper. They just made that up. I'm just asking. I'm just trying to get a, an idea. No, okay. Um, she will have. She yeah. have a Jessica Bills, but she would have. Who's type of swag? What's that girl, man? What's that girl named Rita Ora? She have her swag. Her, her voice would be. Jennifer Lopez had a dope the way she talked, like regular talking, not like. Just talking in general. She would talk like Jennifer Lopez, have an ass like Jessica Biel, mm -hmm. and an and a, a Rita or a swag. Rita or a swag. Right. And then um, what else an appearance you want to know about? I don't know. I'm I think so that's confused. everything. <laughs> Such a weird. <laughs> I mean, look at the shirt I got on. No, I see it. True. Would I have a normal person next to me? <laughs> <laughs> would she wear a shirt like this? Maybe. Who knows? Cut up. Cut up. <laughs> small, Cut up. Extra small. Cut up. <laughs> Off the shoulder. Just definitely not keeper. Put keeper's picture there. <laughs> sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs>